all going youtube welcome back to the page welcome back to the channel welcome back to the episode of next our flex where we talk about upcoming shoes that we're gonna buy or drop let's get into this so first on the list we're gonna be talking about the gum pack this i want to nickname and call it the yin yang pack because one of them is black and white and the other one is white and black that's the better name the yin yang pack this right here is kind of cool i'm not a big fan of these shoes so i'm not gonna cop but i could see why you guys will go after it these are scheduled to come out next year i don't know the date or the price but all it says is 2023 if you guys didn't know this year is the anniversary of air forces and that's where they're dropping so many air forces and this one right here is clean this is your cream and burgundy air force lows and these are going crazy i think it's part of the college pack it's going to be this and then a navy colorway i'm definitely feeling the burgundy for the fall time these are going to be clean another air force coming out is going to be the air force low since 82 in the baby blue colorway these are fire these are clean get your hands on them i know for a fact the price range is a bit high because this is going to be 150 but the quality the leather quality that they put into this shoe is definitely fire i seen the all white paint person smooth clean this one a cop talking about blue colorway here is a dunk low in the reverse unc's now I'm tired of dunks. If it's not an SB dunk, I'm kind of straying away. But this one is, is okay. It's cool for the summertime. Summer's almost over, so I don't know why they're dropping this now. But this is a cool colorway. These are supposedly dropping soon, but the summer's almost over, like I said. And there hasn't been a release date yet. So keep your eyes open on the sneakers app, because these are going to sell out. Here's a shoe that's on my pass list. I'm not going to hold you. The model is growing on me. I do want to get my hands on the yellow colorway. But do you see this brown? This is the same reason why I thought this shoe was trash is the colorways that they're bringing out. This colorway is poop, literally, dog poop brown. I know some people are feeling this, they're gonna be nice for the fall time, but I'm not. The first colorway clean, the yellow colorway nice, but this one right here, easy, easy pass. Another shoe that's gonna be a pass for me is going to be the Black Phantoms, the Travis Jordan 1 Lows. These right here are different in no way, bro. They're all black shoes with the white stitching. I feel like that's why a lot of people are gonna go crazy for them. For me, it's gonna be a pass. If I get my hands on this, it gotta be retail only, and I'm gonna trade them for the other tree Travis Scott that I think is way better. This one is the lower tier for all the other Travis Scott lows that came out. This I'm not really a fan of. You guys let me know. Are you guys feeling this? Or are you guys gonna cop? Another shoe that I'm not feeling and I think is a lazy cop out is going to be the Armour Minear Airship One. Now these are, like I said, simple and a cop out. A cop out meaning they didn't put no effort into this shoe, no creativity. It's a blue and white shoe, nothing about it screams collab besides the little tab that says Armour Minear, and then it's gonna be limited as hell. Because it's so limited, because it's so simple, I'm not feeling it. When it comes to collabs, I need something crazy, I need some creativity to be put into the shoe, and this right here has none. Another Armour Minear colorway coming out is going to be on the Jordan 12s. These right here is technically your rusty, dusty, moldy, ashy flu games. That's it. Yo, the leak pictures are not doing their shoes justice. Just like the leak pictures for the uh, Jordan 4s, those were horrible. But the official pictures, the official image, clean. The leak pictures for this, horrible. And I bashed it on TikTok. But if you guys seen the official pictures for the kids, you'd be like, damn. They actually look like they have lotion this time. But the first picture that I seen, they needed lotion and that's why I said I'm gonna pass. If the official picture come out and it looks good, I might change my mind because I flip flop on everything. I don't give a hell. I have so much flip flop cards in my back pocket, I could use them for years to come. But this right here so far is gonna be a pass for me. And like I said, they are the Ashy McGee's. A shoe that's all about creativity though is going to be the Bapesta and Marvel collab. These right here are fire. This is supposed to come out today. So if you guys cop whenever you're watching this video, let me me know let me know which one did you cop did you get the captain americas did you get the rockets did you get who else is coming out the black widows iron man did you get your hands on any of them the hulk is pretty cool too i like that colorway for me i think the rocket one is the one that i would go after because it's more wearable to me the packaging is supposed to be the same as the ogs when they first came out so i know a lot of people is going after these so let me know guys did you cop or did you even try to go after this a shoe that i'm not even going to try for is going to be the per moss and uh, reebok shoe now the first og colorways fire 
The new colorways have been trash. This is on, I'm not gonna hold you, the colorway make it on this list and it's going to be the super garbage sauce list because this is bad. I feel like the color just don't match the shoe. This is an easy pass. But you know what's not a pass is going to be this news right here. We are getting the Pirate Black 350s, yes. Yeezy's bringing out all the 350 V1s and I'm hyped. I already have the Moon Rocks. I'm gonna make sure before the year's up I get my hand on the Turtle Doves, but this next year is definitely gonna be copped. These are fire. Are you guys happy he's coming out with all the old shoes? Or are you guys waiting for him to drop the 750 again? Cause I am. Comment down below and let me know which Yeezy would you want him to retro next. Now back to the Jordan side, we have a Jordan 2 low coming out and honestly these are Another sleeper, the colorway doesn't scream collab. Now this is a collab from Shelf Life and I'm not gonna hold you. Shout out to the African group for doing this right here. But for me, I need a little bit more creativity. This is gonna be a next. A shoe that you guys are gonna be surprised that I'm actually hyped and I wanna get is going to be the Dub Zero. Yes, I said it. The Dub Zero Legend Blue is coming back out or Photo Blue, whatever you wanna call them. These are fire. They just bring me back to my childhood when I wanted this colorway and I didn't get it. These are gonna come home. I don't care what y'all say, this is a cop. Another shoe on the garbage sauce list is going to be these Jordan 1 mids. This is why people didn't like mids in the first place. You guys were doing so great, Jordan brand. You was doing good, making nice colorways, and then you do this. What is this? Nobody asked for this, nobody want this. They like that y'all was giving mids nice colorways, but now you're bringing up the reason why we don't like mids. This right here is booty. This right here is a pass. Super garbage sauce. Burn it with a lighter torch because these are trash. But if you like them, go ahead. Don't let my opinion stray you away from wearing them. Remember, buy what you love, wear what you like. But for me, these are not it. Another shoe on this list, which is not it, is going to be a shoe from your favorite ALD. They never miss. They're always hidden. Well, this is a miss because what the hell is this? This is the ALD New Balance Rainer. This is trash. I don't care if it's a hiking boot or rain boot, it's trash, it's garbage. This could have been a regular GR shoe that nobody cared about, but y'all gonna hype it up by giving it a collab stamp and that's why it is trash. But let's get into the news of what's dropping this week and first up is going to be the Sakai Cortez Low. These are fire. They are not on the sneaker app yet. I'm getting upset because I need these. These are coming out on the 23rd, a few days from now, and they're not uploaded. I need these in the collection. These are clean. I need the Forrest Gump colorway and the gray colorway. Nike, hurry up and put them on the sneakers app because I need these. Coming out on the 24th is gonna be a Dunk Low, the avocado or the pears, whatever you call them. These right here. Uh, I understand, I get the theme, you wear them. The uh, upper is supposed to shed away just like how a pear or well, avocado shed away. These are not it. They're kind of boring. I'm not feeling it. But if you love the theme and you love the colorway, this is a cop. A shoe that I'm excited about and I spoke about before on the 24th is going to be these right here. These Dunk Highs. They're fire. They're nice. These are the Fro Skate Dunk Highs and they come out on the 24th like I said. These are clean. Get your hands on them. They're giving me a what the mismatch type vibe and I'm digging that. And for the price range of 130, you can't really go wrong. It's a collab, good colorway, easy to wear. Well, not really easy to wear, but still fun to wear. So on the 26th, we're gonna get these Dunk High Bear Root, whatever they're called, is gonna be a burgundy and gray. This is a pass, easy, don't need them. Look, I'm just telling you guys because I'm pretty sure you guys love dunks and this is definitely going to be nice for the fall time. But for right now, in my collection, don't need. Another shoe that I don't need is going to be the Stealth 12s. These are, they're okay. They're cool. I'm just not feeling them. They come out on the 27th. Let me know if you're going to cop them because I'm not. So to my surprise, this next shoe has been selling out and now they're reselling. Don't know why, but hey, to each his own. This is the Penny One Homes. The Away sold out and they're selling. So I'm pretty sure that the Homes going to sell out and they're going to resell too but this one is fire but this one is fire and it comes out on the 25th for 170 dollars get your hands on them if you're a fan of the pennies and you want them in the collection get them i'm not gonna hold you try your luck make sure you go into the sneaker stores too because online everything sells out but it's probably gonna sit in store i'm not too sure but still get your hands on them try and do your due diligence and get these shoes now I'm not gonna hold you, the shoe of the week for me is going to be these West Indy Air Force One. Now, I'm not a big fan of the colorway. I think they should have done better, but the shoe is iconic 
and I'm definitely gonna try and get my hands on these. These are fire. There's a whole bunch of other colorways that come out, but guess what? Eh, not coming out right now. It's only gonna be this one right here, the white and green. And I honestly think they're nice. It's a nice little shoe if you're really trying to get into Air Forces or you just want a shoe that you missed out in, in the past. But yo guys, that's it. Let me know which shoe you're going after. Let me know if you're even hyped for any of these shoes, the rumors and the releases. Besides that, love, manas, and always respect. We out of here. Yeah.